But it's no surprise, however, with severe weather when it, in the wintertime, that could mean flight delays. Yeah. Many people get frustrated because of a canceled or delayed flight caused by the weather. The same thing can happen to pilots in training at the University of North Dakota. Our responsibility is to make sure everybody is uh, being safe. So if there's big weather issues coming in, um, we're going to uh, determine the best course of action. Supervisors of flight, or SOFs, help pilots in the sky from on the ground. Not all weather affects flights, but there are some specifics to look out for. During the winter time, icing is our biggest concern. Other than icing, the SOFs look out for wind and cold measurements as well when operating flights. Sometimes it is actually the pilot's personal preference though. We, there were several people coming back that were saying it's way too cold, I, my fingers are feeling bad, so went no fly anyway for that situation. Katrina says that the main thing is always safety, and it is the SOF's job to assure this. We'll be calling out to the uh, other flights that are in the area, asking for pilot reports of what's the weather doing, um, you know, how is it affecting your flight at this time, how can we help you get you to a place that's uh, safe. So even though flying can defy gravity, it does not always defy the weather. With photographer Alex Stadnick, I'm Tasha Olson reporting for Studio One. That brings us back to our weather question of the week, and is what or what is the total in the southern part of the United States? Uh, the amount of snow that is needed in for a winter storm warning, our answer is ranging from one to four inches. Answer is a whopping two inches, which isn't really a whole lot for us to compare to in the northern part of the state mm -hmm. or country. And actually, uh, Callan, how much snow does it take? How many inches would it be for us to get a warning here in the Midwest? Three times as much at six inches. All right. Well, thank you. Thank you.